Hi, I'm Terry Dunn. I'm the RC columnist for Tested.com, and um, I've been into RC all my life, and now I write about RC. I do um, mostly airplanes, but also quadcopters, boats, cars, and uh, pretty much anything RC is what I write about for Tested. And this is a project that I did for the website, and uh, if you're familiar with the movie Airplane, this is um, a creation based on the box art from that movie. And it's based on a, a chuck glider, just a little foam glider for kids, from about 10 years ago, which is no longer made, but I saved one because they're great RC conversions. And to make the knot, I got a pull noodle, tied it in a knot, and grafted it to the front. So although it looks like a Boeing 757, you kind of get the idea. And uh, it's very simple, uh, two channel, or excuse me, three channel control. Um, Taylor rods in the back, so two surfaces, and a Rimfire 250 motor running on three cells. And I test flew it before I added the knot, and it flew spectacularly. Then I added the knot, and it was not airworthy anymore. So uh, I did some experimentation, and turns out I had to add a really huge rudder to make it work. So that's why it looks the way it does. But it's a caricature of an airplane, and it flies well enough, and people get a kick out of it. They sure do, yeah. I'll bet. After we put this online, we see more of these in the air. You think? Yeah. That would be great. <laughs> I'd love to see more people take initiative to, to try things that they don't know about. Yeah, so. the tail. Uh, you, you say it's a huge tail, but really, it looks good. Maybe it's the way you painted it. It but. could be. If you had seen the original, you mm -hmm. would say, wow, that is huge. But yeah, I agree. Several people have noted that it doesn't look terribly out of place yeah. on an airplane with a, a knot in the front. Yeah. So, yeah. Yeah. What's your primary focus with your articles? Do you, do you review a product or do you um, review the idea of a product like your quad pop? Or? There are okay. some things that are just straight up product reviews. Most of it is with the intent of guys who are new to RC, like the traditional tested readers, Here's what it's all about, and here's how you learn. So I'm taking a teaching role more than anything. Okay, so you're really trying to get more people involved into the hobby. Right. 